Hello everyone. This little baby boy just woke up. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Oh, he's purring. Oh, little Lord Byron. Well guys, welcome back to the glorious life of a glorified gold digger, Laura Lash. In the previous chapter, we found the man that we chose to go after, Nikolai, canoodling with Zomara, our enemy, in the competition. And not only were they just together on the roof, they were like hugging and probably kissing, doing all these other naughty things. And like, I am aghast, I am shocked, I am petrified and angry like how could he so now we are obviously gonna have to figure out what's happening and if they are like romantic and if he has feelings for her because then that's rude like we chose him over Mateo even though I love Mateo so much you might just have to pick Mateo right, right? anyway this is a billionaire bachelor's chapter 8 and this is little LB's Instagram my Instagram TikTok give us a follow a like Such a baby. You grow so fast. So yeah, as I've stated, this is Billionaire Bachelors Chapter 8. Let's go. This is going to be intense, guys. I'm ready for the drama. The sleeves are pulled up and I'm ready. Okay, what's going to happen? Okay, I still have that dreaded hair. <gasps> ah, ew, with my enemy. Oh, did he just push her off? What do you think you're doing? I feel like you're getting close to Laura. I just wanted to tell you that Laura is fake. She's a player and she's lying to everyone in this house. Actually, I'm like the most honest person here. I said I'm a gold digger. I said I'm looking for the richest wallet there is. And I said that if I do get a cute guy to boot with that, why not? So I'm pretty sure I'm honest. So Mara, did I ask your opinion on the matter? It's just, it's just that your jealousy seems to cloud your judgment. <gasps> oh, hello there. Why, who do we have here? Oh, my little baby sneeze. Oh, I just took off Zomar's. Miss Lash, were you looking for me? No, no, just wanted some fresh air on the roof. The world doesn't revolve around you. Yeah, that's what I'm, I don't know. He was kind of sitting up for me. I don't know if I should be rude. I'm gonna say yes. Yes. <laughs> Why did you leave? It looked like you were busy. <laughs> Are you having fun? Cause I'm not. Very much. You're jealous. Um, no, I just don't like Zomara. There's a difference. <laughs> jealous because of me. Ooh, is this the first time you actually like a girl enough to make her jealous? And yes, I like it. I feel a kind of satisfaction when your attention is on me. But you should remember the first rule of business. The rule is to give and take. If I give you my attention, you have to give me yours. I'll be glad to comply. Aww. Whoa, okay. Okay. Nikolai started leaving hot kisses from the hollow of my throat to my jawline. Oh. You were so darn sassy that it should be illegal for you to be walking around here wearing this. Well, I mean, yeah, give me a fine. <laughs> then he gripped the hem of my top. Oh, okay. And finally connected his lips to mine. I guess I did make kind of a decent decision. And good thing I didn't like get all mad and angry at him. I wonder, guys, if any of you played this, don't spoil it, but if I picked another option, like the world doesn't revolve around you, what would his answer be? Like, would we fight? Would we still be doing this? Or would there be a completely different scenario here? I don't know, I'm so curious. Ooh, I hope Mateo's not hurt. Okay. Uh, this is gonna be so hard. All these love triangles kill me. Ooh, workout time. It's good to have you back, Laura. And you're glowing. Does this mean that things are going well with Nikolai? Oh, yeah. yeah. Don't try to deny it. Everyone can see it clearly. Can they? To be honest, for a moment, I thought that there's something between Laura and Matteo. Matteo acted strangely when she was in Paris. I suspect tonight's coupling will be full of surprises. <gasps> it's true. Yes, but another couple will be eliminated. Then let's go make ourselves flawless. If one of us will be eliminated tonight, at least she'll do it in style. Ooh, shampoo, guys. We're finally using some soap. Oh, is this sabotage shampoo? <gasps> oh my God. Guys, our hair just keeps getting worse and worse. <laughs> ah! Right then, what's the emergency? Oh, wow. Um, Did you cut your own hair or? No! Someone replaced my shampoo with hair removal cream. I look like I got run over by a lawnmower. It's not that bad. Oh. Okay, it's catastrophic. 
Look, babe, I've done a lot of these shows. People always try to bring down the strongest competition. You should wear this like a badge of honor. Yeah, I don't think my um, billionaires are gonna think the same thing. You think I'm the strongest competitor? You've already got two billionaires falling head over heels for you. And I can think of a few girls who have none. So what do I do? You rock these circumstances. Hmm. Choose a premium hairstyle for the rest of the story. Okay, no, no. Just those two? Debut a new look. Show up like this at the company? I'm so tempted to just show up like that. <laughs> Um, debut a new look, okay. I have to make a big statement at the coupling to show the billionaires that I can take any obstacle in life and love, and I will. Fine, I'll have, I'll have a new look. I miss my old hair, guys. What happened to that hair? It just disappeared. Awesome, now how shall we fix your hair? Um, long straight purple blonde, curly braids pink pastel. I like the long straight purple. Purples are color. Ooh. OMG, you look incredible. Whoever attempted to sabotage you is going to be so jelly when they see you at the coupling. You better get ready for tonight's coupling. I will. You know what? I cannot wait to see the look on their faces tonight. I'm ready to rock this coupling. Spaghetti blue dress, silver con dress, mini black dress. Oh god, so many choices. I hate choices. Okay, mm, that kind of matches her new hair. No, let me, let's look at all of them. You guys in the comments always want me to try all the dresses on. Oh, that kind of matches her hair too. And no, I don't like this. Too simple for her. Next, spaghetti white dress. Oh, um, no. Okay, silver contrast. Let's go. She looks like a pop star. Yes. Let's go. Mm, I'm all ready. <gasps> Gasp everywhere. How is this fair? She gets a brand new design and haircut and we're all just left here looking like this? Ooh. Laura, your hair looks amazing. Seriously, you look out of this world stunning. I agree. Thank you, girls. That's my girl. <laughs> okay, so what about the other reactions? We need to know which girl sabotaged us. Or boy. Bachelors and bachelorettes. Two weeks have already passed since the start of the competition. During which we saw both the best and the worst of our contestants. Jealousy. Friendships. And maybe even love. Now let's move on to the events that will take place tonight. The coupling felt like a blur until finally it was Nikolai's turn to pick. <gasps> Who are you going to pick? Now it's Nikolai O'Sullivan's turn. So Mara and Laura. Okay, I'm ready. You're the last girls. This is a tough choice, really tough. Okay, you know what? Just for that statement alone, we're dumping you. We're going with Mateo. Bye. You dare compare us with Zomara. Like seriously, after like all those cute things you were like doing together with us, like really? No, no. So I'm going to do what any CEO in my position would do. Have the girls pitch to me. Excuse me? You're so bad, I love it. You expect us to try to entice you like we're an investment opportunity? Isn't love the biggest investment of all? Nicola's eyes narrowed into the cocky, sassy smirk I'd grown to love. The heat between us was palpable, and the crooked smile on his face sent shivers down my spine. God, I wanted him. So Mara, why don't you go first? Um, okay, we are not pitching. I can guarantee you guys this. I'm the sassiest woman you've ever seen. I'm way more fun. And how much more is there to explore with Laura, really? Hasn't she gotten a bit stale since Paris? Give me another try. I've got surprises in store. Really? Did you take a class in something? She doesn't know him at all. She doesn't know what will entice him. Now it's my turn and I know just what to say to turn Nicolas head my way. Well, I'm not going to because I don't like you right now. So I'm actually really, really pissed off how you dared even like compare me to her. Why don't you pitch to me here on the show? We are equals. You know how you feel when you're around me. Choose whoever you want. Why don't you pitch to me? I've got options too. <gasps> <laughs> Laura, you always know just how to play the game. And by that, I mean you know I don't play. I don't care for a woman who's throwing herself at my feet, desperate for my attention. But a woman who holds herself to a high standard, a woman who needs to be chased. I, I, it's true, it's true, I do know. She's the one I want to be coupled with. I choose Laura. Okay. Oh, no, Mateo! <gasps> No after party tonight because Andrew and I are hosting an awards show. See you all tomorrow. Toodles. Bye. Oh my God. How are you feeling? Not good. I'm going to say not great. Not great. Anything I can do? Yeah, you can stop annoying me and confusing me. I think we need to have a frank conversation. Very well. I pride myself on being honest to a fault, so I value that in others. 
We are a couple together and I definitely have feelings for you. But there's something there between Mateo and I. And I need to keep my heart open while we're in the house. Because I'm not sure where it lies yet. I appreciate that. And if you eventually do choose me, I want you to be sure and never regret the decision to be with me. I understand. Thank you for this, Laura. I look forward to our week coupled together. Now, if you'll excuse me, I would like to enjoy myself on our evening all. Would you care to join me? Uh, I'd rather spend it with Mateo. Ah, guys, I don't know. Uh, okay, so, no, I'm gonna spend it with Mateo. You really annoyed me today. Let's go. No, thank you. I'll see you later then. Wow, he's being so cool with everything. Clearly, you don't like me that much. Come in. Laura, I'm so glad you called. He looks so cute. I can't think of anyone I'd rather spend the evening with. Same, but I wish we could get off campus a little. This house is starting to feel confined. I know exactly how you feel. Having a camera shoved constantly in your face makes it hard to really let go and be ourselves. What do you say we make an escape? <gasps> Where will we go? How about for a ride? Oh yes, my sports car fanatic, let's go. There's this estate hillside where you have sweeping panoramas of the city. No one will see us there. How do you know we won't be spotted? Well, I own the estate, so what do you say? Yay, we finally get to see how rich Mateo is. Score! Okay, let's go. Let's go. Share an intimate moment with Mateo. Tonight could be my only chance to see what Mateo's like away from the cameras. I should sneak away with my boo. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, motorcycle. Mateo made a call and the next thing I knew we were racing away on his motorcycle. I can't believe you own a motorbike. I can't believe you think I only own one. <laughs> I love that answer, boo. Love it. Where are we going? You'll see. Okay. I'm ready. Helicopter? He had a private helicopter pick us up before whisking us away. When I was a child, my mother would take my brother and I to the beach. I didn't know you had brothers. I have three brothers. I'm the youngest. Baby? Perhaps that's why you're so competitive. It's also why I don't like to share. Growing up with so many brothers, it was hard to have things that were just mine. I know you're coupled with O'Sullivan, and I know you have some feelings for him. But I have to tell you, I'm all in this with you. Oh, cutie, I love you. I want you, Laura. I want all of you. See, now that is passion. That is love. And that is a man who's not going to be playing and trifling with my feelings. I'm going to kiss him. Let's go. Aww. There's one more thing I have to show you before we go back to the mansion. Your house? Wow. Sunrise. It's giving the house with Mateo was the breath of fresh air I needed to clear my head. As we watched the sun rising over the hills, I felt safe, loved, and appreciated. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I'm really starting to like fully fall for Mateo over here. Mateo continued to open up to me and show me his soft side, vulnerable and gentle. I felt myself falling for him even further as he wrapped his arms around me and kissed the nape of my neck. It was certainly a night like no other. It certainly was. And it's morning, guys. Let's go. It's a new sunny day at Miami Beach. Let's start with a good outfit. Jeans and a white top, ripped skirt. Okay, let's look at all of them. Okay, that does not go with your new hair, girl. Uh, that's more like it, but let me try one more. Yeah, that. That's cute. Why not? Oh, Laura, I'm glad you're here. I was wondering if we could go somewhere to talk in private. Oh, private. What's happening? Okay, let's go. Oh, Nicolette's gonna stop us? No? Okay. Breakfast. I had a lot of fun with you last night. Even more when we snuck out like teenagers. But this morning I woke up and realized I needed to come clean about something. <gasps> what? What? Saved by the bell, I guess. No, I want to say this now. Are you married? But everyone's waiting for us. They can wait a little longer. Mateo, I don't know what's going on with you. One second you seem to be saying that you care for me. And we sneak out the house for a romantic rendezvous. But then you have secrets to confess and you're choosing someone else like coupling? Instead of answering me, he laid his hands on my waist. His lips connected with mine and the confusion washed away from me. I could only think of how well his lips moved against mine and of how I could feel how his pulse was increasing. I want to... Uh... Should I kiss him back? No, I'm kind of confused right now. Push him away. Mateo, I can't. We should go to the announcement room before they send someone to find us. I... <gasps> Uh, hello everyone, what's happening? What's happening? Oh my god. Contestants. Yes. Whoa, what is this, Dancing with the Stars? Today, you'll compete in the most sensual dance in the world. Get ready for this dance challenge. And join us here. And if you aren't good at dancing, don't worry if you make a mistake and get all tangled up, you just salsa on. Okay. Oh yes, finally a sassy challenge. Everyone knows that salsa is a dance of love. But who will my partner be, Mateo or Nikolai? 
Okay, so that was it for this chapter. That's intense. Did I literally lose my chance for Mateo to tell me something? Was it really important? Oh my god, now I'm gonna stress about it all day. Oh my god, I need to know what it is. Like, ugh. Okay, anyway. Anyway. So many, like, tough options in this whole game. Anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying this chapter and story. Make sure you guys check out Byron's Instagram, my Instagram, TikTok. Give this video a huge like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you guys later. Bye.